Well, good evening. I'm Jeff Russo from 7 Eyewitness News, and we're taking you through the 716 in two minutes. There is more support tonight for a bill supporters hope can better protect everyone inside a vehicle. As we reported last month, 28 states require people wear a seatbelt in the back seat. New York only requires people under 16 and anyone sitting in the front seat to buckle up. A bill now in the state Senate would change all of that. Both AAA and the Medical Society of New York called on state lawmakers to try and pass that today. West Seneca police still aren't sure if the teen who died in that crash over the weekend was wearing his seatbelt. 17-year-old Tyler Wachowski of Sloan died early Sunday morning. Police say he ran a stop sign at the corner of Langner and Fisher Roads. He lost control of the car and crashed the car, then caught on fire. Police do believe speed was a factor, but it could take up to eight weeks to determine if alcohol played a role. Well, tonight, Bills fans are hoping for the best for one of their own. Ezra Castro, also known as Pancho Bila, is resting in his hospital bed tonight. Castro was continuing his brave fight against cancer, but a post on his Twitter feed tonight says the medication he is on leaves him unable to communicate. A post on Change Dot. Or now calling for Bills fans to sign the Superfan to a one-day contract. The franchise overall to now sign him also to a one-day contract. Time now to check into the forecast. Here's 7 First Alert meteorologist Andy Parker. All right, we have one more gray day. I'll show it to you as we get into our Tuesday. We're still going to see these uh, areas of rain moving on through. It's not a constant waterworks on Tuesday, but the further we get into it, the better it looks. We'll start clearing out the skies and setting the stage for a bit of sunshine on Wednesday, but even that day won't go fully without some showers. A little bit of fog in the morning. Here's your seven day forecast. Again, some breaks in the clouds on Wednesday. Thursday has some sudden clouds there.